I will like to say not only do we expose a lot of waste, fraud, and abuse in the Tennessee Pork Report, we don't just complain about it, we also offer solutions. Now we'd love to stop gathering uh, you here every year in order to, to uncover this type of waste, but ultimately in order to do that, our local and state officials must get their acts together to eliminate waste, fraud, and abuse across our state. So some of the examples of solutions that we have offered in the Pork Report include reforming our state spending cap, known as the Copeland cap, enacting a kicker law that would return surplus revenue back to taxpayers' pockets, and establishing an independent commission that would be tasked with analyzing the state budget line by line. Equally important is accountability at the local level. As Comptroller Justin Wilson has acknowledged recently, there is a much pervasive waste and fraud at the local level. So local officials should take a number of actions to correct this. They should create audit committees to analyze their budgets. They should maintain sufficient rainy day funds, impose debt disclosure requirements for taxpayers, and most importantly, overhaul their financial management systems altogether. Until these reforms are instituted, we'll be coming back year after year, exposing the most egregious examples of government waste. 